You have your proof yet? Great. Set that over there, and let me know when you've completed the trial of speed. Excellent. Right this way, please. Well, where is he? Meow. Charmed, I'm sure. <laughs> Are you kidding me? You wish to challenge me like this? Careful what you say, King. My species has no bearing on my abilities. I have no problems with cats, Manny, or goblins, or sphinxes. My issues are all with you. No matter. The duel hasn't even begun, yet I've already won. Are you aware that you've hand-delivered everything I need to complete another batch of Cosmolotion? Shocker. Allow me to explain that you, King Graham the Imbecile, have once again... Yeah, 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 yeah. Wax poetic for two more hours, won't you? Pardon my vacant expression, though. I can barely hear out of my left ear anymore. Fine. Have it your way. I'll speak with brevity. Long sentences. Drawn out syllables to emphasize a point. Raising my voice. More sesquipedalian words. Overuse of the term moron. And I'll need a hair from your beard for my final ingredient. See where it's sundown? Meet me at the floating island. Good chat. Dad, we brought you some treats. Dad? Oh. Wow. Oh. Grandpa! Oh. oh. Dad, say something. Story. Gwendolyn, go get the nursemaids. No. What do you want me to do? What, what can I get you? You want mom? Mom! Story. Sorry? No, story. The story. Help me finish it. Let's get him back in bed. Grab his feet. Couldn't reach the bell. I should have known you would try to escape. I thought I needed one more adventure. One last trophy to hang on these shelves. But the only treasures I need are standing right beside me. It's okay, love. You can stop fighting. It's time. Not before my story is done. You have to finish it. Me? I don't know how it ends. I'll help you. 
I, I can't. I'm not ready. Gart should tell it. Grandfather's passing his hat to you. I think you should take it. Go ahead, Pedalbug. King Grandpa, the greatest adventurer to ever live, would do anything in his power to protect his family. As the sun set, Atop the floating island, Mordak placed the final goblet down for a toxic duel of wits. That's a great start. Welcome, friend. I'm glad you could make it. Mananan restored himself back into human form using the ingredients Grandpa had unknowingly brought to him. But he was weak. The germite crystal was the only thing keeping him alive. Mordak has carefully designed a series of trials to test our wits. Don't worry, he hasn't given me any answers. Some of the goblets have been topped with hypnotic powder. We will complete each station individually. If you drink from any of the tainted cups, you will lose and be under my spell, and vice versa. The goblets have been set up in stations, each with their own rules. I'll spare you the long speech and just let you read the rules. Ready to prove a goblin is smarter than a man? Stay away from that. It's not needed yet. <laughs> 